Really, the uh, the Appalachia Ohio Zero Waste Initiative is a is a collaborative effort to try and turn uh, the region's waste liability into an asset for job creation and healthier communities. We try and improve the region's ability to reduce waste and increase recycling through improving infrastructure in the region, informing policy, engaging community stakeholders and elected officials, and trying to develop incentives to create economic development from utilizing these materials. To help identify strategies that could be useful in this rural region of the state, we've conducted uh, case studies with other solid waste districts around the state of Ohio that are best practices, looking to see what strategies might make sense for our local solid waste district to implement that met those needs that the community has identified. Waste is something that everyone contributes to. It's something that each person has a choice every day on what they consume and what they dispose. And it's one thing that we have the choice to change. Um, we can each choose to reduce waste in our personal lives. We can each choose to recycle. Recycling is basically voting for a better future. In the first couple of years of the Zero Waste Initiative, a primary focus was to develop a needs assessment uh, so that we could identify what residents and businesses needed in terms of um, better access to recycling, as well as identifying the challenges and some of the gaps that needed to be filled within the waste management stream so that more material could be not only diverted from the landfill, but also used to create wealth within the local, within the two counties. Rural Action's AmeriCorps program has uh, two AmeriCorps members that work on the Zero Waste Initiative go out and engage community members, teach at schools, develop cleanups for community efforts, and go out and do waste audits. They're really an arm of the project that can really communicate on, a, on the ground level with the community. Right now, we're, this project has been going for about two and a half years and we're reaching a critical mass of people's understanding of this issue and engagement with it. And by the end of this year, I feel that we will have a substantial improvement in our infrastructure and collaboration among stakeholders to understand this issue and be able to move it forward. Ultimately, you know, this project is, is not looking at waste, but it's looking at resources. And that's purely what these materials are, everything around you could be considered waste at some point. But let's try and understand how these are resources for our community and how they relate to our self-sufficiency.